Hello all, welcome to Apna Corona channel and I hope your preparation is going in very good direction because one good news is for you that exam date for married SCQC both the both scientists B and STA is announced now. Okay. So in this video, I will tell you the exam date for both the post. In, in addition to that, I will also tell you the competition level, which is very much important for us to know that to which number of people we need to fight, right? For our vacancy, that is your one post. So let's start our video quickly. Okay, so your exam date is 21st of November, okay, which is on Sunday. Your STA paper, those who feel STA form, your paper will be from 9.30 a.m. in morning, definitely, and you know that it is three hours okay and those who feel scientists be form your paper will be on 2 30 pm to 5 30 pm okay and those who feel both the forms you have your both the paper on the same day okay so this is the same day schedule for both the post second number of second thing the number of applications okay so let me remind you this is the updated vacancy as all uh, a few means lots of people know already that the vacancy gets got revised right so this is the revised vacancy for cs there are five vacancy for it three vacancy for electronics total 10 vacancies are there right now we will see the number of applications which is not exactly your competition but it will be near okay competition number will be near to this so you can see for cs5 post total 4550 applications are there okay for it3 post total 1158 applications are there and for electronics 10 post total 5176 applications are there so you can see here for total 18 post we have 10884 okay we will we don't want this count actually now the very much important thing from this what is that for general and obc okay if you see general count for all the branches and obc count then both for this both category the applicants are more as compared to your EWS, SC and ST, okay? And though, suppose here for CS, there is no vacancy for ST. So, those who applied in ST, you will consider in general only, okay? So, don't think like uh, you applied in ST. Uh, they mentioned that don't apply in ST because there is no vacancy, but still you guys apply, but okay, they will consider you in general category, okay? So, now you know your target for this one vacancy of yours. This is the hurdle which we need to cross together, right? So, just don't worry about anything i will making the strategy video and hopefully today night or tomorrow day you will get it okay now this is for scientist b let's go to your sta part so for sta that is scientific assistant total vacancies for cac are 16 for it 13 and for ec 34 vacancies are there okay now we will see the competition levels okay so for cac for 16 post Total 5,896 applicants are there for STA post. Then for electronics, 7,773 because a few branches are also there. Okay, MCA people was eligible like, like that. So just uh, 2,000 number is increased. Definitely, I hope that those 5,000 students will be common for both the STA and scientist B post. Okay, as we discussed already in the past about our strategy that how you can maximize your chances of selection in NILET. Okay, like that. And for Oh, sorry, for electronics, 34 vacancies are there for that 7773 and for IT, 13 vacancies and 1926. So, we, we can uh, we can see that for IT, little bit less competition, but still 13 for 13 vacancies only. Okay. Here, your target is to come in merit only. There is no interview. As you, okay, let me remind you, there is no interview. So, for CAC, you are, you should be in top 16. For IT, you should be in 13, top 13 and for EC, you should be in th top 34. When you set this target, then it will help you to achieve it. Okay. That's why this is very much important thing you to understand. And for scientists, we definitely interview is there, but don't consider that interview at all. Okay. Because there is no use of it because you are written test having 85% of weightage and only 15% of weightage is for interview and from yesterday only uh, last previous post of NILET that is for NIC okay interview gets started so all the best to you guys also that who uh, who give already interview okay now if it's okay that you are not getting into NIC but this is the final opportunity you have because before two months approximately they announce the date okay which is a very good thing actually so now how we can properly prepare okay and we can move ahead our journey 
objective towards the final selection all those things in very much detail okay and that will be your final preparation strategy video for nilet in all the things i will combine and i will discuss in this video so just wait for that till then continue your preparation continue your revision i hope that at least now my expectation from you are 90% syllabus should get complete okay till now because from last december i am making continuous videos on that okay i guess lots of study video i share with you in that also i mention so maximum public those who complete 90% syllabus okay if you not complete 90% syllabus then is also okay now is your chance because you have two months okay but don't think like that i will make i will uh, just categorize these two things those who complete the syllabus those who have 90% or 80% syllabus and those who are just starting the preparation actually this is not the right time to start okay if you can see the number of applications and competition but still i will make all the three categories and based on that i will tell you the strategy okay so just wait for a few hours definitely i will meet you again all the best